we've got two giveaways this year. Dr. Finkelstein, 250 subscribers. All you have to do is subscribe to the channel. If you, we draw your name, I'll mail this one to you free of charge. Yay! We're giving it to you. And the other one is... Bullseye and Jesse, limited edition. Um, all you have to do is click on the video for Bullseye and Jesse and comment your favorite quote line from any of the Toy Story movies. Welcome back to Chris's Corner. We've got another video here in the Hallmark Keepsake Ornament Collection. And in this series is the Transformers series. This is another favorite of mine. Probably my most favorite one. I thought that was the Bumblebee. No. Oh. Bumblebee, yes, because he's a bug and I own a Volkswagen. No, this was my favorite one. I have no idea why. Maybe it was because of all the little tape cassette things that came out of them. But this is sound, sound wave from 2017. The scary boom box. No, it wasn't a boom box. That was Blaster. Oh, Blaster was the boom box. You're telling me that I he's, believe that he's literally just a tape deck? He's a, he's a Walkman. Yeah, that's really frightening. He's a Walkman. Mm -hmm. So well, he would play my Duran Duran cassette. Well, no, because it was a toy. It didn't really work. <laughs> Silence is deadly. <laughs> it was not supposed to be frightening when they're in um, not robot form, but whatever form that they take. Okay, I have a question. Okay. If he's a Walkman, for yes. lack of better wording, and the other dude is a gun. Dude. Where Megatron? are, like, where are Me they? Megatron is not Do a... they just, like, hang out in somebody's toy box? If you call Megatron a dude... <laughs> He would have shot you in the face. <laughs> My point is, I get the first guy. What's his name? Prime. I get him. He's a truck. He can drive places, yes. right? Yes. I get that. Yes. Bumblebee is a bug. He drives places. Most of the auto bots are autos. Are okay, I got autos that. Or cars. So where does the most of them? Where do the mundane dudes? Sorry, toys hang out. Does the gun just, like, hang out in somebody's closet with the tape deck? Well, no. Their base of operations was out in the ocean underneath the water. That's where they're So when do they transform into non-robots? Well, when the, 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 the jets, when they were going moving from place to place, would turn into jets. Okay, I'm go. not asking about the jet. I'm asking about the gun and the tape deck. Well, no, he would stay in robot form. He could fly it as a gun in I'm robot I'm sorry, form. what now? <laughs> Flying gun? No, flying robot. Gun. That turned into a gun. Okay, so back to this guy. <laughs> Heather was never a fan of the Transformers, as you can tell. It's not that. <coughs> I was a girl. I played with Barbies. You were a girl. I played with Barbies, oh, okay. right? That's what we did when I was a kid. I didn't come running home from school and play with my gun and tape deck that transformed into robots. My next door neighbor's sister... Played with Barbies, and so did we. And our Transformers would just kick the crap out of their Barbies. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, yeah. yeah. We'd shoot their heads off. Body parts would go flying as well. You're a sick human being. <laughs> anyway, let's keep going. Okay. When this ornament was released, it was... 1595 U.S. 1999 Canadian. And when you uh, look online t today, you can find this at third-party sites going for about a hundred US. Wow. Yeah. Wow. It's, it's like third highest priced one I believe that's out. I wow. think Grimlock. No, uh, the first Prime is the most expensive, then Grimlock, then this one I believe. Wow. You want to read the back? Yep. Remember the neighbor could who... <laughs> I started reading it and it made me laugh. <laughs> Remember the neighbor kid who would dismantle perfectly good toys and mash the parts together to create strange creatures? Did, didn't I just say we did that? <laughs> yep. Amazing, yep, you did. Orville Wilson was that kid, and he still is. After winning an art contest in elementary school, his mother said, One day you'll be working for Hallmark. She was thrilled when her prophecy came true. 
And like any good mother, she said, I told you so. <laughs> yeah, you were the neighbor kid that dismantled toys. Yes. Yes, I was the Glad neighbor. I didn't live next door to you. I was the neighbor kid that dismantled toys. Wow. Oh, look. This one's properly packaged. Comes in plastic? It does come in plastic. Look at that. It's facing the wrong way. Well, hey. Wow. Do you see the parts that are the tape deck? Yeah, it's right there. Yeah, well, and then all the rest of it. Uh, the gun and the rocket launcher were batteries. To go okay, in, they look like batteries. I get to go that. In the, in the back, yeah. Okay. And then you've got the play buttons. Okay. And the eject button for the tape deck. Okay. Where does his head go? Just kind of turns around and folds underneath. God, that's going to hurt. See the opening? Okay. That's, just, that's what I like about the, these uh, G1 Hallmark ones. They're, they're almost molded right off of what the G1 Transformers used to look like. Oh, it actually says record and stop. That's cute. Yep. That's cool. I mean, not knowing the toys myself, that it does look like it's really well done. And that means he's a Minicon. A, a mean a con? Yeah, Decepticon. Same thing. He's a, yeah, he's a bad guy. Yes. A bad a con? No, that doesn't sound right. He's cool. But he came with multiple tapes. Well, Mul what? Multiple tapes. Well, there what was did the Rumble, tapes do? Ravage, um, Laser Beak, uh, and then this. But what did the tapes do? Did they, they... Were, they were smaller Decepticons that popped out of him that he could reinforce. What, like an it. alien? No, it didn't. Yeah, it came out of his chest. They didn't crawl out of his chest like an alien. No. He reached... Are you actually getting frustrated with me right now? <laughs> he would press his little side button here, and the tape deck would fly open, and then so the robot, rumble and the ravage. The robot would and... press his own eject button. Yes. And another robot would shoot out. Yes. Okay. See? And, um, why did you just say that? And then I actually have one of the original. Here's right. one of my original... Transformers, and he's the cat. Oh, well, that's kind of cool. So this guy would shoot out that tape deck, and a cat would come out. Yeah, well, it was the cat. There was the cat. There was the bird. Okay. Or pterodactyl kind of thing. Okay. <laughs> that was laser beak. Sure. And then there was two smaller robot characters uh rant as it i think this was rampage okay it was rumble and he had like jackhammers for hands and they'd slam into the ground and he'd create like huge earthquakes okay yeah. mm -hmm. there was four to start and then i think they came out with a few other ones and they did they all actually fit in the not all of them all at once I think two no. or three would fit in at oh, a time. Really? Yeah. Oh. Well, however okay. deep the actual G1 uh, sound wave was. So how big were these guys then? Like. Well, if this is the actual size of his tape. Oh, so they were fair size. One of the easier ones to turn back into tape mode. So if that's, he was probably a little bigger than, oh, than that. Maybe. Okay. Maybe about that big. Yeah, see, Barbie didn't transform into anything. No. She just put on her evening wear and her shoes and no, was so a good girl. She transformed in. Nighttime to daytime. Do you mm -hmm. want to call that transforming? Yeah, well, we won't say what she was transforming into doing. You know, Barbie had to make, pay the bills somehow, right? <gasps> <laughs> My Barbie never. <laughs> and she also didn't shoot robots <coughs> out of her chest. And... Again, it doesn't shoot them out of his chest. They just come out of his chest. They're reinforcements. <laughs> but the detail on this ornament is really good. It is. It, it's, it is it's, very cool. It's very true to... It looks like a 1980s toy. Like, yeah. It really does. The only problem with that similarity is this is plastic. And they were metal, right? Yeah, the ones... Oh! Don't... don't Oh, he's not supposed to he's move. He's not supposed no. to move. Then why did he move? Uh, because you were trying to break him. Well, no. no, no, they don't move. Oh, no. okay. Well, I won't They're... try to move him then. 
It looks like he should. It looks like he should, yes, but well, he doesn't. I want to make it move. Well, no, we'll, then we'll have to buy the actual toy. <laughs> no, we don't. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. no. If anyone has one they want to give to Chris. <laughs> <laughs> trade you an ornament. For oh, good grief. <laughs> Again, probably my favorite Transformer was. He's very cool. Was Soundwave. Just, he had the best voice. In the cartoon, it was very robotic. Yeah. Okay. He didn't make the movies, I take it? Uh, yeah, he did eventually. Did he? he wasn't in the first couple. He, uh, Due to popular demand, I think uh, fans were quite irate that he hadn't made it in yet. And he made it into the movie event eventually. I had so many different issues with those movies that it had really nothing to do with the, the Transformers themselves. I really think people wanted a G1 version of the transformers movies not this over cgi cgi change the characters and the voices and all the rest of that they eventually did they've <clears throat> they've made prime into a cab over for the past two movies now i believe and there's another one coming out this summer, yeah isn't there? rise of the beast yeah. yeah rise of the beast yeah something like that uh. it, but that's like almost a skip over to the Beast Wars, um, Manimals, or not Manimals, but the, um, version of the cartoon. Okay. Where it was Optimus Primal. Sure. But Prime is still in, Optimus Prime is still in that. Okay. So he does come with the clamshell. It's a weird clamshell. I mean, it's and it just half the shell. Yeah. He sits in there face first. Poor guy. He doesn't have a back cover i assume that that's just yeah, that's fine okay and, then... and as he goes away i uh, just remind you again we've got those two ornaments to give away uh, please go over to those two videos and like subscribe comment, comment and we really want to give these things away uh if you also want to comment comment on any of the the videos that we make um which ones you're interested in um, I can look into getting them for another giveaway in the future. Just give us an idea. Yep. Well, we've also got the tree giveaway this uh, Christmas to a needy family. Well, we're giving away two trees this year. Last year was just one. Yep. I believe we've got a couple of trees set aside or in the works to get. Yeah, we just need some ornaments to decorate. So yeah. if you want to be part of that, please let us know. My email is in the about section of my YouTube page. I believe it is visible. Just get in contact with us and you can help us along. But until then, you have a very good day. Hello, one and all. <laughs> uh, Heather and I in from behind the camera. We're trying to remind everybody, we've got two giveaways this year. Dr. Finkelstein, 250 subscribers. All you have to do is subscribe to the channel. If you, we draw your name, I'll mail this one to you free of charge. Yay! We're giving it to you. And the other one is... Bullseye and Jesse, limited edition. Um, all you have to do is click on the video for Bullseye and Jesse and comment your favorite quote line from any of the Toy Story movies and we will draw at random you can take Jesse and Bullseye home and we'll do the draw for that that one about two weeks before Christmas so we that said way December 14th. yeah so that you'll get the ornament before Christmas yep. this one as soon as we reach 250 I'll mail it out to you could be next week so the video for this one will be up here the video for that one will be up there above heaven uh, you want free stuff here we go we're going to continue this on as long as this channel lives. Uh, maybe you even want to comment what other ornaments you guys like, and we'll start giving those away as well. Yeah. So, right here, subscribe, guys. comment, free stuff. <laughs>